Welcome back to Lost Ember. We are in the palace and we are about to find out what happened after the riots or during the riots rather. They killed the emperor? Or did the emperor change? What's the father doing? Or what is his role in the story? And uh, did this uprising cause the fall of this whole culture? Which seems to be the case. Are these the living quarters of the palace? There's a memory. Were oh. these your friends? Captured by the Emperor's guard? It's a prison. He had a prison in his palace? This is... This emperor was not the smartest of guys, right? I mean... Oh, there... Yeah. So, that opening is not intentional. Why would you have the prison in your palace? And that's why she broke in here, to rescue her fellow uprisers. Yeah, they sneak out. Totem. Kalani totem. Kalani's symbol carved into stone. Looks like her followers were imprisoned here. And they carved that. Their name. But uh, they carved my name into stone? Did they worship me now? That's not good either. Wombat. We did check out that, right? Yeah, the door is open. I like that we can open the doors by walking through them. To make them vanish. Okay. Let's see where they snuck to. There's something behind there. Oh, right, I cannot dig. There's nothing behind there. He somehow lost the spirit. At least the visuals of the spirit. It's not with us anymore. Oh. These are fellow wombats. Well, that's good. There are more pots. Oh, hello. A stone figurine of a little boy. Someone carved a simple little figurine of a boy, perhaps portraying a friend of a relative. Yeah, they're maybe made by the same sculpture. They're very similar. Boy, woman. Very cool. There was nothing in that corner. I had to check.
Oh, that's a bummer. That would have been a perfect hiding place for something. <laughs> At least a mushroom. I can't, cannot even see the roof of the building. Or of this room. I mean, we saw from the outside that it's just a huge tower. Oh, there! I can see it! Yeah, it, it's very high. Something glowing back there. A small medicine flask. These flasks were used for various medicines. Maybe this place was the infirmary? Maybe. Right above the prison. That looks cool too, and with the mist behind it. It's like the world ends there. And we must be very high already. Let's go home. Whoa. It's like a. This palace is breathtaking, isn't it? Yeah. Like a cavern. The sheer number of people it must have taken to build this. Yeah, and to carve it out of the mountain. Because we saw that from the outside. It's not a built tower. It's carved out of a mountain. That's pretty crazy. The game next time has an autosave. I think I reload it so that our spirit will come back. It often happens that if I play a longer time, that the visuals of the spirit disappear and they don't come back. It gets stuck somewhere. Oh, there we have a save. First we look at that though. Huh, now we have the whole family. A stone a male stone figurine. Someone carved a simple little figurine of a man, perhaps portraying a friend. Yeah, it's it's all the same, right? It's interesting that he has some kind of ornamented clothing. She doesn't. Yeah. But apart from that, they are all made in the same style. So, it was probably one person who carved them. I'm missing here too. I think that's one too, right? That's most probably the girl. Then we have the whole family. <laughs> okay. Oh, I wanted to reload. Yep, there it is. Oh gosh, but we are not... Where the last ah checkpoint is not the last save okay now I know that we are here okay I know where we are yeah we went through there this palace is breathtaking isn't it if we picked up the, the other sheer thing. number of people it must have taken to build this. We did. Yep, okay, cool. Let's 
Oh, are we too fast for our spirit? No. <laughs> Just disappears after a while. We are filling up the gaps, that's good. Remains of a musical instrument? Sort of a weird structure. I'm guessing it could have been a musical instrument once. Huh. But made of what? It looks like metal? It's like a harp-like instrument? Or like a xylophone? We're in the throne room. I, I can't believe I'm back here. Yeah, he used to be royalty, right? Or the father. Wow. That's a cool throne room. Like having to the mountains. It would even be cooler if you could see the temple from the throne room, right? Back there in the mountains. Maybe you could. Let me check. No, it's the other side. Yeah, it would be cooler in my opinion, or would be more impressive if this would be the city side and you would look on the temple behind which the sun rises or sets. I don't know in what direction we are looking at, but if I would have built that thing, I would have made it like that. <laughs> but maybe that is like sunrise or sunset. I see the artifact down there, but I think that's where we have to go anyways. So maybe the temple is not orientated through sunrise or to sunrise or sunset, but that one is. And you just look out the opposite side of the city and then the sun sets or rises here and then shines its light on the temple but then it sets behind or rises still behind the temple because it's opposite <laughs> so yes you just could have centered it there and not there right Golden Sun Amulet. A sun amulet resembling the big plate in the sanctuary. Looks quite expensive. But it's a gilded, it seems. Yeah, because it's golden. So <laughs> gilded is golden. It is gold. Gold! Take that actually. What is that? It's the girl. We found it. Someone carved a simple little figurine of girl. Yeah, now we have, I mean, girl, boy, ah, she has, she of course has the skirt. <laughs> That's funny. Ah. Oh, was that the last gap, actually? It 
was. So maybe he found them all. No, no, we didn't. Uh oh. But we did fill up the gaps. That might mean that in this chapter we have found all. That's how it worked before at least. <laughs> Isn't that a water lily? growing there by accident maybe it's not a water lily there was nothing in these
Christ, is he? What have you done? Go after him. And we don't have a choice. And the palace is looking down at the city, but we cannot see the temple because it's on the other side of the ground. Huh? holding me back. Are you happy now? Did you get your revenge? Because now I have no choice but to bring the Emperor your head. You did this, Kalani. Not me. The next time I see you, I'll have to kill you. My men are coming. Run. Do you even realize what you have done? Your revolution burnt down our city. Why should I even help you? There's, there's no hope for you. You deserve what you got. Just leave me alone. It doesn't matter if you're sorry now. Maybe this is how I died. What if you had killed me? The City of Light will never welcome you. That's fine. I like to be a wolf. <laughs> okay. There he goes. I suppose it is the Emperor's soul, right? And he gets punished for what he did too. So the uprising failed. But when she stood up there, she recognized what she did to the people who suffered now like she did when she lost her friend to raging fire. And she did the same to others. Huh. And that's how she got outcast.
I mean, what did they plan exactly to achieve anyways? Do they vote their emperors in? Or what do they do? How do they elect their leaders? Because she didn't claim the leader's name. She threw it out. So who should be a better leader? What's that? Nothing. Dirt. Let me check back here real quick. Or oh, in here, even. Aha! Uh -huh. A bone flute. A musical instrument handcrafted from animal bones. The sound color of each individual one was unique. We have two instruments now. Here, that one and the flute. Very cool. No drums. Nope. Hmm. That's the road we have to take. I mean, if my theory is right and our spirit guide is the Emperor, then he did see his name amulet. Which, by the way, I saw in the cutscene or I recognized in the cutscene had the same clippings as those of the first empress we saw in the sanctuary. So that must be the case for each emperor. They have the same clippings on their name amulets. So when we took it, the spirit must have seen the name of the emperor and he should have recognized his name because that's what he did before, right? He don't remember or doesn't he, rem he remember its name? But when he saw ours, he remembered that he had heard of it so he would for sure had heard of his own name if he saw it right so maybe hmm yeah i don't know i still think it's the emperor or the father but he saw the father too and didn't recognize himself either so i think it's the emperor Is that the barrier that I hear? I mean, the spirit can't leave without us, right? <laughs> we have to break the barrier. The spirit can't. Yeah, it's up there. So we need to find uh, the proper memory to do so. Nope. 
I knew it. <laughs> Miss something here? No, of course not. And honestly, if it is the Emperor, he can have his City of Light for himself. <laughs> I don't know what's so amazing about these afterlife heavens, because they don't seem appealing to me at all. To be honest. <laughs> well, the bad guys are there. Who have been forgiven by their specific gods. I want to be with the cool guys. Yeah, but what a horrible and dull place. I mean... If this is what got you banned from the City of Light, I'm not sure you can ever redeem yourself. I'm sure that what happened was not your intention, but... I'm sure I made some mistakes in my life. I guess everybody deserves a second chance. Come on. We're a team, you and me. I think back. I know what to do. One place you might be forgiven for what you've done. The Temple of the Sun. And what about you? High up in the mountains. Where the ancients stood closest to the City of Light. Above all that lives on Earth. If we can get there, I'm sure you can ask for forgiveness. But what if I don't want forgiveness? I want to roam as a wolf forever. And slipping into other animals. That's the coolest thing I can think of. <laughs> you go to your city of light, which sounds boring as hell. Huh? Well, on the opposite. <laughs> uh, but uh, we'll see about that in the next episodes. I end this one here. Thank you so, so much for watching it. Have a wonderful and adventurous day and goodbye.